guys, it's me, and I'm laughing um, because I'm currently making my third boy doll. My first one is Ayaz, my second one is Jake, and this is my third one. Um, this is my, one of my other um, very, like, long ago, beat up, used our generation dolls. <laughs> and I'm laughing because I'm, like, shearing the hair off. And, um... He looks like a red-haired Joey Gladstone. I wanted to show. Um. So, um. So that's what I've got right now. His hair. <laughs> it's just like Joey Gladstone's from Full House. It's not even funny. It's just a red-haired Joey Gladstone with a bunch of blush and a really weird mouth. But um. Yeah, I don't know what his name is yet. I'm still cutting hair. Um, that's all the hair that I've sheared off of him. This huge, matted, disgusting thing. Mia looks gorgeous, doesn't she? Sorry. Um, but yeah, I'm shearing doll hair at 9 o'clock at night, so... Fun. But yeah, um, a doll update is coming... Shortly. Um, I will um, do that soon, but as you can see, this room is a mess. And I was planning on trying to clear a little bit of space so I can make a formal doll update since it's still snowy outside where I live. And it's freezing cold, so we can't necessarily do it outside. But, um, there aren't too many new, whoops, girlies. Um, Unless you include Jake, then it's kind of grown to a bit of a crazy number that I haven't really done much um, topic on. But, yeah. I don't have a name for him yet, so um, I have to think of a name. But I have an outfit laid over there for him. And we're going to continue cutting his hair a little shorter because it's still kind of long. And um, I'll come back in a minute. Hey guys, it's me again, and I'm in my bathroom because the lighting's way better in here than in my doll room. Um, but I'm here with um, my third boy doll, and I don't have a name for him yet, but um, he's looking pretty good, if you ask me. Um, he's wearing um, Isaac's meat shirt that he came in, and underneath he has this um, short sleeve. Um, shirt that was my bitty babies um, and AM gave it to me um, it's not actual American Girl shirt it's um, it was from a seller at um, a craft fair with an outfit and then he's wearing Sage's um, sweater outfit pants and these black sneakers that Jake was wearing but now he's wearing and I think I did a really good job on his hair. Um, oh, Jesus <laughs> um, Christ, he fell. Um, he keeps falling and his hair keeps getting messed up because he won't stand up straight. Um, his legs are like rubber. They're like actually rubber legs. So they're not plastic. So that's part of the reason he falls over his legs are completely unsturdy um so I have him leaning up against my makeup thing but um he looks pretty good um let's see if I can there we go his hair was wavy well wavish curlyish before um, I cut it so that kind of went with his form um when he turned into a boy and I probably have to cut his eyelashes down just a little bit to make him look a little less feminine and a little more masculine, if you know what I mean. Because when you lay him down, his eyelashes are really long. And I probably have to do the same thing with Jake because they both will look really feminine laying down like that. Um, so yeah, um, I don't have a name for him yet, but he looks pretty good considering the circumstances. I finished cutting his hair and he looks pretty good. And his hair was really bad. I don't have any before pictures of him because I didn't think to take them until I had already cut his ponytail halfway off. 
So, um, yeah, he's really great, and he is, again, one of my old Our Generation dolls. He has the same hands as I as and Justin do. I mean, not Justin, um, Jake. Jeez. Um, so yeah, this is boy doll number three, and hopefully there will be more where that came from in the future. Um, but if you have an old, like, doll, you know, 18-inch doll that you don't use, or you can get a cheap one at, like, um, Target or something. His eyes are wonky. Okay, I just realized that. Um, <laughs> so he's, like, really completely unsturdy. Um, and, yeah, that thing's busted, so I have to fix that. But, um, if you have an old large generation doll with messed up hair, you know, you can just cut the hair down and use some water and put it back to a reasonable looking thing and make it a boy doll. And that's what I did with my two old our generation dolls that were girls. They are now boys. Um, and I will have a name. I just have to think of one. Um, I have a bunch written down in the list, but I haven't gotten a chance to look at them and choose which one's right for him. So I have to do that soon. Um, but yeah, until that happens, um, he doesn't have a name yet, so soon he'll have a name. I think he has, like, silver eye or something in that eye, because see how that eye is, like, way darker than that eye. Okay, that's really creepy. All right, you've kind of, I've kind of got a messed up doll here. Yay me, all right. <laughs> um, that's enough for now. Um, thank you for watching my little introduction to no name um i don't know what i'm gonna name him yet so um i'll see you guys soon bye hey guys it's ashley and <laughs> totally entry but that's because i'm setting the music this song is like an amazing song it's from my childhood so yeah but um i'm here because i finally decided on the name for this guy and his name is Ashton and Ashton happens to be Miss Isabel's boyfriend so pluck her up Isabel <laughs> no um she's not going to be puckering up <laughs> um but it's an adorable couple um is this one's gonna totally push him over I just know it or not okay um this adorable couple is here to bring you announcement so this is probably this is supposed to be a surprise announcement but probably isn't it's going to be um considering you guys are probably be like ugh again and I swear that every time that I postpone the doll update cue the groans screams and any other possible occurrences um, <laughs> um, that, um, it's for logical explanation, um, maybe not normal all the time because most people aren't deathly ill, Lyme disease, um, not deathly ill, but I don't look so hot, <laughs> not supposed to be this pale with huge bags in my eyes, it's because I'm sick, um, <laughs> but, um, So this time it is not for that reason though. It is for the other reason um, that one, I went to the room to be completely cleaned up so I could do a formal doll update with no mess and to have it look nice. Um, and I have to have a couple days to do that. And two, I have a surprise and I'm not going to tell you what it is. But there is a really big reason why I'm not doing it just yet. Mess or no mess, so you'll see. Just a little bit longer, guys, and the doll update will be here shortly. But it's actually ironic, I was just thinking that while I was talking, um, that these two happen to be paired together because she's the newest girl and he's the newest boy. So they're kind of like the new couple. So it's like new, new, new all over the place. So it's really interesting. Um, so yeah, they're really cute. So it's Isabel and Ashton and their boyfriend girlfriend. So yeah, thanks for watching.
Bye.